Hello again everyone, how are you all? Hope you're all well. Today we are back with Attic Attack by Ultimate Play the Game. And I know this is an absolute true classic and a game that defines the ZX Spectrum. And you know me, I'm a big Spectrum fan. But i got a confession. I think I played this once as a kid. Didn't have a clue what I was doing and I've never come back to it. I was speaking to uh, Scott, Sega Zombie, and he said this is just one of those games that he came back to and played again and again and again. And I hear this all the time. But I didn't know what I was doing. And I still don't know what I'm doing. So the whole idea of this video is I'm going to play it like I played it back when I was a kid, having no clue what I was doing. And this is going to be a part one, because I'm going to ask your guys' advice, what am I supposed to be doing in this game? And then I'll read the comments, practice, and come back with a proper review of this game. Because I don't think it's fair giving this game a review when I don't know what I'm doing. So without further ado, let's play Attic Attack like I did back when I was a kid. Right, so here we are at the main screen, and this is what greeted me when I was a child. Now, I didn't know what any of these characters do. Please let me know what are the differences in the characters. Why are they there? Please, that's the first thing I want to know. Why? So let me know in the comments below what you're supposed to do with those different characters and why you'd pick a certain one over another. Um, but yes, back in the day, as when I said I've only loaded it up once, I've probably loaded it up a few times. It was just one of those games, like Dizzy Games, and I'm going to say it now, I don't like Dizzy. Sorry, don't kill me. Um, but it's just, again, another one which I didn't understand. And it's not so much a hatred for the game, because hate there's a very strong word is hate. It's just I had no clue. And back when I was younger, games that I could pick up and play easily were great games to play. Games that I hadn't got a clue, I just didn't have a clue. You know? But I like the open worldness of it, even though I didn't have a clue. You know, uh, another one that's only just recently discovered how to play was Trapdoor. You know? And that's going to be a game I'm going to have to do a, a video on as well because, again, it was great walking around, but I didn't have a clue. So that's what this is video is going to be, is just showing you how I used to play it. And please give me your tints and tips and advice, and I'll come back and review this game properly. Right, anyway, enough waffle. Let's get on with it. Uh, we're going zero to start game. So, this is what I was greeted with. And it's just rooms. I, I, I love the fact that you could walk around like this. It was really quite fast. Nice and colourful. I'm sitting here and I'm shooting the monsters. Um, for no reason, not knowing why to kill the monsters, because I keep coming back. And then I've got another room. And that's pretty much what happened. I just kept going to different rooms. I know these put your health up. I'm sure these put your health up. Uh, let's have a look. Because it's that chicken that's disappearing on the side there. Yes. That's what they do. So, does anything happen with this guy? No. Anything with a picture? No, just axes bouncing everywhere. Sometimes doors are open. Sometimes doors are closed. Now, this. Am I supposed to pick this up? What am I supposed to do with that? Again, please let me know in the comments below. Uh, any fans of this game are probably screaming at the screens now, going, do this, do this, do this. Please write it in the comments. Um, with your help, hopefully I'm going to figure out what I'm supposed to do in this game. Because there, and the door just shuts behind me, look. Not a clue. Just got to sit here and wait, sit here and wait, try not to die, get back out. Now, clearly the doors are different colours for a reason. I've got to find some food, haven't I? I'm going to die. Oh, there we go. I've got something. And I know there's holes in the floor. Like here. Like that door is different colour to that door. And they flash open and closed. Oh, get that one. I need that. Oh, no. No, it's shut. No. No. <laughs> Getting stuck in rooms like this. Ta used to take all my energy off. Now get back out of there. Now, holes in the floor. Where's that leading me to? Please let me know. Why have I got to use them? Another hole in the floor. Should we go down it? Yeah, why not? I do like that, though. Just give you a sense of you are... And now I'm stuck. There we are. Go this way. No, can't go that way. Oh, a key. See, how, how do I pick that up? Please, am I missing a button? Are you, are you, should I just read the instructions? Is that a good mushroom or is that a bad mushroom? That's bad mushroom. Now, this is what happened. I just used to aimlessly wander around. Occasionally find something that I could pick up. 
And that, that's pretty much it, you know? I, I really, really need your help, guys. Oh, I do like the death animation. That's quite fun. But, yeah, I just don't know. Skeleton guy, does he do anything? Now, I know that this game is a classic, right? As I said, I've heard this of so many people that this was a must-play Spectrum game. A lot of people would say that this is like their favourite game of all time on the Spectrum. Now, was I, was I too quick to just put this game down and load up something else? No, 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 no. Oh, I did. I did. <laughs> Can't kill them once. So I hope this video has not been... Oh, no, no, no. I want to go at the other door. I want to go at the other door. Oh. I'm dead again. Go, 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 go. Okay, right. Is there buttons here that I can press? Okay, what, what button did I just press that picked that key up? What button did I press? Oh, I always hate it when they put the controls on the actual keyboard. It's probably why I did... No, oh, I'm dead. It's probably why... At least I figured something out. Keys, keys. What keys use the, um, play the game? I really should read the instructions, shouldn't I? But I'm putting it to you guys. I know this has been a bit of a crazy video, but this is pretty much how I experienced it when I was a kid. I hadn't got a clue. And I'm 39 years old, and I still haven't got a clue. So please let me know in the comments down below what I'm supposed to be doing this game, what the what I'm supposed to be collecting, where I'm supposed to be going, stuff like that, and I will practice. I promise I will practice. And I will come back and give you my honest thoughts of reviewing Attic Attack for the first time playthrough in 2022. So that's all today's video was. It's not really a review. It's just a, please help me. I need help. Anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching, and I will see you all again next time.